In this video I will show you how to create portrait videos for TikTok, Instagram and other social media pages. Hello everyone. Welcome to Solly Tutorials. To create portrait videos for TikTok, Instagram and other social media pages, you need to open the Filmora software. After opening the software, I click on media. I have landscape video in this folder. I select it and click open. So I imported the video to the software. Drag and drop the video to the timeline. Now we have to set the project settings. Click display settings. Then click on change project aspect ratio. Here inside the project settings, keep the aspect ratio 916 portrait. You can set the resolution to your choice. I have a resolution of 1080 by 1920. Set the frame rate to 25. It will look like this on the screen. Now select this video and click on Crop Tool. Inside the Crop Tool, make the ratio 916. Within this ratio select the relevant area in your video. OK. So you can see that the area we wanted to crop has been cropped correctly. If you have two specific items in your video and you want to adjust it in THR portrait area. So copy this video for that. Add a new empty video track above. Paste the copied video into this track. Select the video above and click crop tool. Adjust the crop area by placing it on your other footage. OK. I also check this video to see if our main footage has gone out of the crop area. So in this video too, we have placed the crop area in the right place. The next step is to split the video above every 2 seconds. As I do, you can split it into more or less lengths. This will let you know in the next step what we are going to do. After splitting, delete every other part of the video split above. That way we can show all the footage in our video. We will now place bars at the top and bottom of the video. Click on the sample colors for this. Here you will find pictures in many colors. You can choose any color picture of your choice for your video bar. From here, I drag and drop the lilac picture into the track above the timeline. After dragging, select the picture. Slightly lower the picture height on the display screen. And make some bar out of it. And then place this bar position on the top side of the video. Adjust the duration of the picture according to the video below. Copy this picture. Add a new empty track above. Paste the copied picture into this track. After pasting, select the picture of this track. And move the picture strip position of this track to the bottom side of the video. So you can see we made two beautiful bars on the top and bottom side of the video. Then we will create a line animation equal to the length of the video. To do this, drag and drop the white color picture from the colors into the track above the timeline. Place the position of this picture on the bottom bar. Reduce the height of this picture and make a short line like this. Click display settings. From here, you can adjust the zoom level to your liking so that you can see the display screen correctly. And you have no problem working. Next, drag and drop the red color picture into the track above the timeline. That's right. Increase the durations of both pictures according to the tracks below. Draw a line from this red picture like a white color picture. Double click on the red color picture. Go to the animation tab and click on it. And then click the customize section. 
Add a keyframe to the start of the red color picture. Reduce the height of the red picture in this keyframe. And make a line like the white color picture line. The red line should be placed above the white line. Also zoom in and zoom out the display screen. So that you can work easily. After doing this, move the playhead to the end of this picture. And add an empty keyframe here. Move the playhead back to the first keyframe. Zoom the display screen. In this keyframe, the end of the red line has to be moved to the start head like this. That's right. So you can see that we made a line animation like this. This line allows people to estimate the length of the video. What is the length of the video? How much we watched this video and how much time was left to watch the video. Then we need to add text to the video. Go to titles and click on it. From here, drag and drop the default title to the timeline. Double click on the title. Move the text to the top bar and edit the title. At the top of the bar, write whatever you want according to your video. I write, swimming is good for you. Adjust the position of the text correctly on the top bar. Align the title. Choose a nice font of your choice. Select text style within presets. Right click on this title and copy it. Add a new empty track above. And paste the copied title into this track. Move the position of this title to the bottom bar. Edit this title and write more. Change the font for the text below. OK. Increase the duration of both titles according to the tracks below. Now I want to split the above title into four parts. And then write separate sentences in them. To do this, move the playhead to the center of the title. Split the top title here in the middle. Then split both parts in the middle. Now I will edit the other three titles. After editing the text, click on the animation section inside the titles. Apply the animation of your choice to the titles. I apply Dumo Design Animation to all the titles of the track above. To apply animation you need to double click on the animation. After applying the animation, the last thing we have to do is add the logo. Go to Media and click on it. And then click on Project Media. Click the Import Media button and import the logo from your relevant folder. So I imported the Instagram logo. Drag and drop the logo into the track above the timeline. Select the logo. And make the size of the logo smaller like this. Zoom the screen to your liking to adjust the position of the logo correctly. As well as adjusting the position of the logo, rotate the logo a bit. Increase the duration of the logo according to the tracks below. So with that we made a portrait video like this. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. 
If you like this video then give this video a thumbs up, plus subscribe to this channel and also hit the bell icon. But don't leave without sharing this video and leave your comment below. Also visit my second YouTube channel Royal Solly where you will find some great videos. See you soon. Peace.